Amy, I'm learning more about entering transactions in Microsoft Money. But what should I put under category? Can I just leave it blank? You can, but then you're not taking advantage of some of the benefits money can provide. With categories, we can track our income and expenses, so we'll know where all our money's going. Using categories will also help us at tax time and when we budget. So this is where I tell money what the transaction was for? Right. There are two ways you can see categories and subcategories. What do you mean? Well, you can see them this way, with the category and subcategory together. Or you can see them this way, with the category in one box and the subcategory in the other. Oh, I see. How do you switch between the two? You just go to Tools, Options, Categories. Uh-huh. And select or clear this second checkbox. I think I can figure out what to do next. This check was for food, and the subcategory would be groceries. Right. And look, as soon as we press Enter, money lets us know how we're doing on the spending limits we set up for food. So we can see whether we're spending more or less than we planned for this category. Okay. Here's another way to do it. For the next transaction, type in the category. Okay. Automobile. A U. Hey, it filled in the rest for me. Tricky, huh? Now type a colon and then the subcategory. How about gasoline? It filled it in again. Yep. Now the next one is for our monthly house cleaning bill. Since this is a recurring monthly bill, let's categorize it under bills. And even though house cleaning is not on the list of standard subcategories, we can add it ourselves. This means we can customize the categories for anything we need. Now you just press enter. And money helps me create the new category. This wizard makes it easy. Let's check it out. Your new subcategory got added to the list already. This is great. Not only are money's categories easy to use, but we can create reports with them and analyze our taxes and budget. This will really help us see what's going on with our personal finances.